Hello and welcome to the walk around video of the 430i M Sport Coupe here at your next car. So of course we're going to begin the walk around of the exterior of the car whilst I talk you through some of the features and options. Then I'll make my way around, I'll go ahead and take a seat inside the vehicle. Well once we're there we'll go through some of the interior features. The vehicle itself is presented in the very nice, very popular Snap Rocks blue. And of course we finished the exterior off with the full bespoke Your Next Car M Forms body styling kit which we've done a very nice 50-50 mix of satin and of course the body colour of Snap Rocks Blue, all of which you'll see as we go around the car. The alloy wheels are the 704M 19 inch optional extra alloy wheels, which are finished in the original by Orbit Grey, and all of which are in very nice condition. This vehicle benefits from the full BMW M Sport Plus Pack, so we get some much larger front and rear brakes, and a few other options included Harman Kardon, heated leather seats, and the privacy glass. The vehicle is a 2018-18 plate, so we get the facelift headlights, tail lights, and a few interior features as well. As we make our way around the car, you will noticeably see that the Snap Rocks Blue is a very nice colour, especially out in today's sunlight. So starting at the very front, where we can see starting of which of them and brakes at the front, you'll also note the gloss black air breather, and of course not forgetting that very nice 50-50 Snap Rocks Blue and satin black front splitter. Down the side we've got the satin side vinyls, the Snap Rocks Blue sidebars and we've also done the M4 style mirror caps. Moving on for a quick glance at the interior where we have the exclusive black Dakota leather with the oyster stitching. These seats are not only heated we also have the electric function for the passenger side and memory for the drivers. You'll also find inside the Harman Kardon once again thanks to the M Sport Plus pack. In the rear is a very comfortable Isofix rear bench with the centre folding armrest and is a exceptionally clean and tidy interior, much like the exterior on this car. There is that privacy glass, of course. And once again, you can really see how much the sun does make this colour really stand out from the crowd. Making our way to the very rear of the car where we find the face shifted rear lights. We've got that lovely 50-50 mixture of the satin outers and the Snap Rocks Blue inner diffuser. On top, the gloss black rear boot spoiler, which sits on the tailgate. Opening that up reveals just how large the boot space is for a coupe vehicle. This can be made larger, thankfully, to the fact we have the split folding seat function on this vehicle. Moving on to the other side now, where once again, I'm gonna quickly make my way through and we'll go and take a seat inside the driver's side. Not before showing you off the 19 inch alloy wheels once again. There is that memory settings for the driver's side. Okay, so now we're sat inside the vehicle. Straight away we'll see the very nice high gloss and brushed aluminium trim inside the car. We've also got equipped on this car the professional wide navigation and media. Front and rear parking sensors. There is the navigation screen. If I click the main menu button, we can see that we've got the connected drive plus with the enabled online search function. News and weather apps all powered by Google, a fantastic function which makes life day-to-day -day life easier, enabling you to Google search anything you pretty much well would like to. We've got Bluetooth audio and Bluetooth telephone, DAB radio and a wide array of multimedia functions. Also equipped is this superb 8-speed sports auto gearbox. You'll also find on the multifunction M Sport steering wheel the cruise, speed limiter, voice and volume functions. The vehicle itself has covered just over 54,000 miles. Once again, heading back to the main menu, we'll take a look at the vehicle service status and service requirements. As you can see, it's not due a service for 14,000 miles, and we can view all of the digital service history of the car. It was last serviced at 48432, where it had a major service, including all of the filters and the spark plugs which is fantastic news for the potential next owner of this car, as it does mean the next service is just a very basic oil and oil filter change. You'll also notice on here on the indicator stop, we have the high beam assist. This will toggle the low to high beam on a dark lit road and it will on see oncoming vehicles before you can. Okay, so we'll finish off the walk around by just saying, of course, if you do want to check out any further information regarding the pricing or finance options of this car or any of our others, I will leave a link down in the description for our website and also you can check out the further still images of this car. Thank you very much for watching. Do of course take care. We hope to see you very, very soon. Thank you. Goodbye.